corruption. Give us space on the other paper to have this matter debated. It is two months down the road. The world is aware that there's corruption in this parliament. We want this matter to be debated. Why are you running away from that debate? You are meant to be neutral. Give space for all of us equally. Why are you making us suffer? Running through this country looking for signatures to debate this matter of corruption in this parliament. You need to come out clean. Right on the speaker, you, right on over Anita Among, has been painted out for being corrupt. You name, your name has been mentioned for being corrupt. We are also having a motion to have a matter debated on the commissioners. We have our evidence. We want to lay and have them defend themselves. You are all blocking us from that. What is this parliament all about? Where are you taking this country? Today, this country is under panic. Today, they have deployed the army massively because of issues of corruption in this country. Why don't you let Ugandans be free from corruption? Why don't you allow us to debate the matter of corruption in this parliament, here in this floor? It is too much. We are not thieves. All these MPs have been painted. If we know we are clean like me, screen me. We have evidence against them. We have evidence. So we need this matter to be debated. You need to clean your name. Deputy Speaker, yourself. Anita Mong needs to clean her name. The commissioners need to clean their names. The ministers need to clean their names. And us MPs, if you have anything against us in this parliament, we need to clean our names. Thank you. Why don't you want this matter to be debated on this floor? Deputy Speaker, we need this matter addressed. Thank you. If not, we are ready to join the Ugandans because you are blocking us the opportunity to debate. We were voted by our voters to come and debate. Why are you running away from debate, Deputy Speaker? Why is Anita Mong running away from debate? Why? We need a parliament which is free corruption. Thank you, Honorable Varion. Th thank you. Now, uh, uh, Honorable Koribs, the Honorable Varion is raising. Uh, I think Honorable. Varyon Nkwani di zanate ugwe mkwano gwafe atu gobelira iranga kujuki zanti subscribe update si Gen Z Uganda na teba genzi masu nukwanga ba posti nga kumukutu ogwa exi nga wagamba nti orunaku orencha na te bakwe karakasa ilaba no wagamba nti bavu milira enguzi e yitiride mkwanga lino elia Uganda ilachi bano wagambi nti wali wo biebasaba government okuwa kulea ebi baruma nga wafubuka abe gwanga lino elia Uganda Gen Z bagambye nti bakusinga na ku Freedom Square era ko chiwandi ko chawe bagambye nti arresting us is not the solution we need answers to our demands resignate echisoka chebasaba resignation of Anita Annet Among as the speaker of Uganda's parliament second resignation of the four backbench commissioners third reducing the number of members of parliament fourth the members of parliament involved in any corruption scandal should resign as investigations go on fifth auditing the lifestyles of all the members of parliament and publicizing it sixth cutting salaries and allowances of all members of parliament to shillings three million seventh allowing ugandans to continuously exercise their democratic nights peacefully assemble without blockage eighth release all arrested people unconditionally stop corruption march to parliament ebyo anga gen z byabasabye government yegwanga lino elya uganda eranga bano bagamba anti bavumirira corruption ayitiride mu gwanga lino elya uganda onaku oregulo kwekarakasa kwa genze maso wawerwa parliament ne mu bitundu ebenja olo mu gwanga lino elya uganda wabula abantu abasinga bakwatidwa police era abalabiddwa konga police eba yisabo binyo abamu byabamenye mikono abalani bamenye kama guru na yenga police na majenga betrode gwanga lino e mu kibuga Kampala